Assalamu alaikum. This question on work and energy, it reads, a truck carrying a 66 kilogram box accelerates uniformly from rest at 1.17 meter per second square for 15 seconds. Calculate the work done on the box during this time interval. So uh, clearly, since we have the uh, initial velocity or speed and the final velocity we can obtain using the equations of motion, because the acceleration is constant, then we can use the work kinetic energy theorem. So according to work kinetic energy theorem, work equals the change in kinetic energy of an object, which means it is half m v final square minus half m v initial square. And since the, uh, it accelerates from rest, so v initial will equal zero. So this term will equal zero. But also we have another information to get the v final, which is the acceleration is constant, which is in magnitude 1.17 meter per second square. And the time interval t equals 15 seconds. So we can use this information since the simplest equation of motion, v final equal v initial plus a t. And since v initial equals 0, so v final equals a t, then we can substitute this. Let me call this 1, call this 2. So substitute 2 in 1, we get that the work done on the object equal change in kinetic energy, which is half m, the mass is, so I can first substitute the abbreviations, a t half mv square, because this is v final square, which is half M is 66 kilograms by A, which is 1.17 squared by T squared, which is 15 squared, which gives 1.02 10 to power 4 joule, because it's the unit of 4 work. Thank you.